everybody, this is Sarah Accioni. You are watching another episode of Your Oxford on social media. So thank you so much for checking out this platform. It's definitely the way we want to be moving to get you the information that's out there throughout Oxford County. Lucky enough today that I am here, I've got Stephanie Radu with the uh, Beachville District Museum. We are hanging out in the back room at Finkel Street Tap and Grill, right? 450 Simcoe Street, downtown Woodstock. Phenomenal lunch and dinner. Come on down if you haven't been down here before. Now, Stephanie, I'm excited. The Beachville District Museum. Yes. Right? Yes. You have so much going on there that people maybe aren't quite aware. What have you got happening? Yeah. So we're we're situated between Woodstock and Ingersoll. We have a number of programs that run annually. Uh, right now, we're gearing up for our summer barbecue, which happens on site on our grounds. And uh, it's a pretty good community event, like great size. It's outdoors. We bring the grills out. We fire up uh, a big fire pit in our back of our grounds and uh, get some of the corn going and Cold, fresh coleslaw and fresh baked pies. So how do you go wrong with that? <laughs> you, you, you don't. <laughs> now that's happening. That's August seventeenth this year, right? Yes, it okay. is. Yeah. So it'll be on the Friday, five to seven p.m. Okay. And everybody's invited. We have tickets online right now, but you can also get them at the museum um, or through our uh, fundraising committee. Perfect. Um, yeah, and it's uh, seventeen dollars for adults, seven dollars for children. Five and under are free. So bring those little nice. ones. And uh, it's a great opportunity to come and see the museum mm -hmm. if you haven't been before so come have dinner yep. then take a look at the exhibits um, and it's a great way to get out and see everybody in the summer too I mean summer is a great time for reconnecting with your community and Definitely. and seeing and just getting out to those events and you don't if you want you don't want to be at home with your own barbecue just let us do the work and come right? and relax and sit who on the doesn't want tables. a night off where you don't have to cook or do dishes really right perfect <laughs> my kind of night yeah um, now I know um, Beachville Museum has a strong tie to baseball we do right yes so uh, Beachville was actually the location of the first recorded baseball game in North America and that was on June 4th 1838 and the museum's really lucky because we've had donors over the year that over the years that have given us uh, artifacts related to that sport so we have a lot of old bases and chest protectors and cedar bats and uh, hometown jerseys and that kind of thing um, but we're not just baseball we have a lot of local history exhibits too that relate to the open face quarries that we have in the area um, and it ranges our artifacts range all over Oxford County so we have pieces from Zora Township we have pieces from Southwest Oxford Township the museum itself is part of a partnership uh, between those two townships so um, so it isn't just Beachville it isn't just baseball oh. um, but th that's why the barbecue is a great event you can come out check out what we have if you haven't right. been in a while we have a fresh new firefighting exhibit that talks about the mutual aid system awesome. uh, of all the fire departments that are in the area as well so there's just so much to come and see and and we encourage everybody to make the short drive out from Woodstock or Ingersoll yeah. and it's and quick you're there it is yeah. it's so quick and in the summertime why not get on the road roll it roll down your windows <laughs> that's right take a cruise to take Beachville a cruise. <laughs> awesome. but you also do some programming for um, like camps and then um, schools can come in and visit as well too exactly yes yeah. so we have summer camp that runs this year from July 2nd all the way through the end of August so if you haven't got your children registered but you still want to send them off for a few weeks <laughs> of, of home, home alone time <laughs> Um, then the museum is a great option. So we do have summer camp uh, that runs uh, 9 to 4, Monday to Friday, and they can register for one day or a whole week or or whatnot for the whole month of August if that's what they if they, if that's what fits in with the schedule. Nice. And it's all outdoor activities and crafting, and we have uh, we have two great summer coordinators running that this year. Um, and then yeah, so when the fall starts again and those kids are back in school, then we're we're reaching out to a lot of the local schools to run field trips and and activities that really connect with their curriculum so school programming will be something that we really uh, kind of uh, di directly Directed. work towards yeah. in September which is really important there's a lot of history and culture in Oxford County that you know what some of the people have lived here forever maybe don't know yeah all the ins and outs and definitely with our community growing the way it's growing there is so many new people coming to Oxford County where immerse yourself there is a lot of cool things here so much history to learn come out to the Beachville District Museum yeah, right. I mean, spend the day. We, we've been talking to a lot of people in our area that say that the children go out to Fanshawe Pioneer Village for a lot of their school yep. trips, and we say, yeah, but we're we're closer. We're right here. <laughs> we're right here, <laughs> and and you know we're so interested in making sure that our artifacts are used and mm -hmm. and um, uh, enlivened. Let's say so we have a lot of um, objects that that really people can engage with, and uh, a lot of little models that showcase you know where the first game of baseball was played, where the old blacksmith shops were. Uh, 
uh, how you know how the game was played in baseball in earlier years because there were um, more bases, there right. were very different rules, um, different terminologies. So it's a uh, there's just it's a very intriguing, very exciting uh, site. So there's lots to see in the kids. There's so much to learn. Yeah, well, as it well. makes history fun for them, right? Comes to life a little bit. Yeah, definitely, that's yeah. important. So any information we want to get about the programs, the museum itself, it's www.beachvilledistrictmuseum.com. Dot com. So yes. Dot com. Make sure you check out that website. Uh, put Friday, August 17th on the calendar for barbecue and walk about the museum. Yes. Stephanie, thanks so much for coming out. Thank you for having us. Can't it's believe we haven't had you before. Well, and everybody has to stop into the museum too. So. That's right, yeah. We'll do a your Oxford field trip. Yes, please. And then there'll be a quiz after. <laughs> no, no quizzes. <laughs> Just for us. Just for fun. <laughs> All right. Thank you, Stephanie. Thank, thank you. you, Finkel Street Tap and Grill, for letting us come in today. Thanks for uh, your staff for taking such good care of our team here at your Oxford. Oxford County, please spread the word. Like, comment, tag a friend, share this episode, check out our other episodes at youroxford.ca, and let's keep spreading the great work that's happening here within Oxford County. Until next time, we'll see you later. Thank you.